Hey YouTube, it's Dylan here, and today I'm doing a rant, and it's not a happy rant, because guess what today is? Today is the day the PlayStation VR headset is being released, and the plan was, I was going to unbox it with Baden, we are going to do a shit ton of gameplay for these guys, just this week was going to be epic, we were going to be doing W2K, videos, we're going to be doing PlayStation VR videos, and it's going to be all for your guys' entertainment, um, and it's going to be a lot of fun for us, and guess what, I've got to wait to motherfucking November to play the PlayStation VR, that is absolutely mind-blowing, um, I pre-ordered it, now, the thing was, I was a part of the second shipment, of the um of the PlayStation VR because the first shipment sold out and that's my fault um I should have pre-ordered it sooner but you know with the Oculus Rift coming out and you know the HTC Vive I thought you know because Oculus Rift that was really popular a lot of people bought that shit that was really really hyped so I wasn't expecting um, PlayStation VR to be sold out so fast um. But I was wrong. And guess what? I feel sorry for the people who are now part of the third shipment. Because the second shipment's already um, sold out. How crazy is that? The second shipment's now sold out. And now the third shipment, you've got to wait till December. You've got to wait two months. It's already been released. You have to wait two months if you pre-ordered it to play the motherfucking thing. And I keep on saying motherfucking because I'm really fucking pissed off. That I wanted to play the PlayStation VR. And now I've got to wait till November to play it, this is crazy, they should have had, why can't they just send out both shipments on the same day, I, I don't, I don't understand it, or the three shipments, send out four fucking shipments, make sure there's enough PlayStation VRs for the people who pre-ordered it, and then also have some in stock for these stores to sell, is that so hard, why do we have to wait like one month or two months to get it, like, I don't, I don't understand that. If you know, please, please explain, like, that's bullshit, like, I pre-ordered it, and, you know, it sells the PlayStation VR, and it just sells the PlayStation VR headset all by itself, you have to buy the Move controllers separately, and then I had to buy all the games separately, because I don't do a fucking bundle, well, they are going to be doing a bundle, but it doesn't come out on the release day, what the fuck is that, you, you got to you got a bundle, but you you decide not to release it on the release day. Like, like we got to wait to December to get the bundle. I, I know why they did that. You know, they want us to buy all the shit separately. They want us to buy the the headset separately, the move controls separately, and the games separately. And that is really um, that is real fucking. That's just I I don't like that shit. You know, um, and that's what I did. I put down pre order. And because I had to um, put down a deposit on every item, I it basically came up to over a hundred bucks, and that's a lot of money, guys. That is a lot of money. And if you're buying this headset, man, it's like over five hundred dollars here in Australia. It's five hundred forty something dollars, I think. Um, man, your wallet's gonna have a big a big dent in it, and I. I most people who are pre-ordering it, they had to pre-order the move controllers and the game separately like I did. So, you guys will be um, investing like $100 already. And you still have to wait to play the thing. So, I just gave $100 of mine as a deposit. And now, I don't even get to fucking play the thing on the release day. I've got to wait till November. What? That doesn't make fucking sense. I think that's just bullshit. And I think... The fact that people who are part of the third shipment got to wait till December. Why can't they just send out two shipments in the same month? Like, I don't, I don't, I don't get it, guys. Um, and guess what? If you're not getting on, I'm telling you now, get on that fucking third shipment. Because if you're part of the fourth shipment, mate, you're going to be waiting till fucking January or maybe next fucking Christmas. Not this Christmas, maybe next fucking Christmas. Be on a fucking joke. I, I, I would have pre-ordered it sooner. But man, Oculus Rift just came out, and I thought, 
you know, everyone's had their, their VR fix, you know, um, you know, they, they wouldn't be really anticipating or really that hyped for PlayStation VR because they just got their Oculus Rift, but I was wrong. Um, it's probably because as well, like Oculus Rift is a lot more expensive than um, PlayStation VR. PlayStation VR is $500 and the Oculus Rift here in Australia, I f the last time I checked, it was like $800. So that's like three hundred dollars more expensive. So and the HTC Vive that is over a thousand dollars. I think that's one thousand one hundred dollars here in Australia. Um, sorry, my my speech is a bit slurred because I'm I'm sick at the moment. I've got this saliva in my mouth all the time. But this video's been gone for five minutes. I don't, I don't want to keep on ranting. I just I needed to let out all my anger and frustration because. Um, um, I was expecting to get my thing, get my, um, my VR headset today, but, nah, gotta wait till motherfucking, it is, at the moment, it's October 13th, so, yeah, it's the 13th, so, it's not, it's, it's still like a couple of weeks away till November, so, I'm not gonna even have my hands on this product, man, for a while. So I can't, I can't do any gameplay of it. I can't do any videos for you guys. Um, yeah, I'm probably gonna have to make it up for you guys. Like, I'm thinking, I'm, I'm, I'm definitely gonna get Battlefield One and the new Call of Duty Modern Warfare because I'm really good at Call of Duty with boots on the ground. So I want to do that. So in the month of like. November, we got, we got Call of Duty coming out, oh yeah, this month we got Battlefield coming out, so, instead of doing P PlayStation VR, um, content, I can be doing Battlefield 1 content for you guys, and, um, I want to get my own PlayStation 4, I was thinking of getting the PlayStation Pro, but I don't know if I want to pay an extra $100 just to get 500 gigabytes of, um, like, you know, storage space to play more games, um, I don't know, I'm still thinking about that. I might get the PlayStation Pro, I don't know. I'm getting the PlayStation VR and that costs heaps and if I'm getting Battlefield that's gonna be that's gonna cost a bit as well, so um I don't know, but I wanna buy a PS4. Because me and my brother are sharing the same PS4 at the moment. So I can do Battlefield One content this this month and then I can make it up for you guys in November and do PlayStation VR and Call of Duty um content in the same month. So So not all not not everything's all bad, but you know, there's there's a plan B, but you know, if it was a perfect world, I'd be doing PlayStation VR content for you today. But sometimes that's not how the cookie crumbles. Anyway, I hope you guys um like this video, and um if you do like this video, I'm, I'm doing more of these vlog videos because I actually enjoy them. Um, please subscribe if you want, and let me know if this has happened to you. Are these guys are these guys having to wait to get your PlayStation VR headset? Let me know, because maybe, maybe you clicked on this video because you're you're in the same sim you're in a similar situation. Um, anyway, see you guys.